might as well do this as well while I'm here, as you'll see here. Um, this this was posted on Twitter, and uh, from like the other side again, George Galloway. Like, if, has there ever been a tyrant whose like feet he hasn't been sucking on? I'm surprised he isn't. He he must be sad that he cannot worship the ground that Netanyahu walks on for political reasons. And here he is again, of course, because all he's motivated for by is just the a hatred of white people, white things, white culture, white history, Europeans, the British Empire, anything us he despises. His wife is a Yemeni. I imagine his children are of foreign descent. Like he's not us. And he goes around and he's smearing l- fucking white people look. Look at this. He he reposts this. And as a journalist, apparently, apparently, I mean, uh, that's almost, a, well, I had to stop myself laughing then. But a former politician as well, a former MP. And once again, you know, I, I know I'm saying, I just said, us those things, and the two of the most, like, disgraced and villainous um, professions uh, in the modern era. As you can see here by, I mean, he's reposting, um, you know, blood libel. He he's just libeling white people here. Um, brave men, are you watching your brave boys? Uh, basically, right there. And then look, it says, um, look at this. Far right protesters in London do Nazi salutes as they defend a war memorial. Now zoom in on this picture because you will not see a single Nazi salute. God forbid somebody throws about Roman salute. Oh my God, it's the end of the day, guys. It's the end of days, guys. You can have like 16,000 Muslims in a street all fucking praying the traffic I move. It's annoying. The fucking, you can't, you can hear it through closed windows. That's fine. That's fine. But God forbid somebody throw up a, a Roman salute. A Roman salute. Oh no. Um. But not one. There's not one. You look. You zoom in on this picture. There is, at the right, there's somebody throwing up the devil horns. Everybody that has their ar- like arms up it with their hands like splayed out as if it could be like a salute, they have both their arms up. They're like putting their arms up to show the police, we're not armed, stop charging us. And, and they're showing them peace signs. There's another one where you can see the fingers uh, are just, it's, it's a convenient photo. Where you don't capture people like actually putting their fingers up in a peace sign. Look at the guy turned around. Doing the same to them. And of course if you look right at the front row. Of course Mr. George Galloway wouldn't do that. He wouldn't investigate the stuff. He just recklessly post it. And repost it on social media. You know which should in his position be a prison. Like it, it should be an offence you should be, be able to hold off to prison for. He's causing white hatred. With his lies. And he is knowingly doing it. You just zoom in in the picture. There's a black guy at the front. And of course you look at his left hand. Two fingers up. Peace. Right hand. Two fingers up in a sort of Baphomet. But we'll say it's peace. Um, Yeah. It's complete. Just a fucking smear. Just a smear. And it's a smear because George Galloway is spiritually Arab. All right, so he looks at this and he just goes, ugh, white people, ugh, white people. Repost. My wife is a Yemeni. He's a sick fucking son of a bitch. Moolah George Galloway. And he, along with Tommy Robinson, Tommy Lennon Yaxley, and Douglas Murray, they should all be put in a fucking boat and just sent out, just sent just fucking the coast of fucking Cornwall and just kick the boat off the fucking pier. See you later, lads. Hope the fucking storm doesn't eat you, scum.